Okay, I'm going to visit a new CEX today. Um, I'm off to Horsham, Horsham in West Sussex, which for me is about 50 miles away. My son lives there. He moved into his new house not long ago, and we're going there to visit him. But lo and behold, I didn't know until I looked, Horsham actually has a CEX about two miles away from my son's house. So, before I get to his, you know where I'm going. I always like visiting a new CEX and having a look what they have. So, let's get on the road and let's get to Horsham. to Horsham where I'm going to park up in the Sainsbury's there and the CEX is just around the corner. So we've just arrived in Horsham Okay, so like I said, we're in Horsham and I think CEX is just up this way around here and up a road somewhere. Bear left on Worthing Road, bear um, 60 yards, bear left onto the path. Yeah, that's the sat nav on. I have to turn that off. There we go. Okay, so I am starting at the peas here because there was other people in my way further down. But there's plane, there's phantom, um, psycho pass, dinosaur thing, I don't know. So this is the first time I've been into this particular CEX, um, Horsham. Never been here before, ever. And I do like to look at it. Reign of Superman, three pound. That's the second part of the Devil Superman storyline. Um, Star Trek's there. Spartacus. This was a great TV series um, when it came out. It still is now. It's, it's four seasons of it. Um, it's well worth a watch. It got really good if it went on. Sharknado 2 there. If you like your shark stuff, SWAT. It's a film I've not got. Not seen that since it came out. Second one there as well. Sahara. Fair few Transformers down there. Um, Silent House. Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock Holmes. Let's go down. Let's have a look. It's got a lent lenticular. Spots between the two. Um, 
Terminator 3. Highly underrated film. It's a lot of fun. It's not great. But it's fun. Best I can say about it. Um, Walking Dead's. Viking. I don't know what that is. I did have a look. Proper look at it. I think. Yes. Yeah, see, I pull it out. What's this about? I don't recognise anyone in it. So, thusly, I might be missing out on a wonderful film there. Am I? Have you seen it? Let me know. The Wave. That's a very good film. It's a Norwegian film. Um, if you can handle subtitles, it's a great movie. X. God, I dislike that film. And look down here. Look, HD DVD there. Yeah. Um, Jurassic Park, Jurassic World, Robin Hood there, look. So, yeah, again, I'm still working backwards, just because there was someone in my way. Um, oh, no, no, I am at the A's. What was that? Was that numbers above? I don't know. I'm lost at what I'm doing, but there we go. Atlantis from Disney. Um, Ant-Man, look, loads of Ant-Man, loads of Marvel stuff. All quite on the Western Front. Um, Airwolf, the complete TV show. Avatar... Ash vs. Evil Dead with a cover by Alex Ross. Alex Ross R on the front of that. He's a comic book cover artist. Um, he's a great artist, actually. Very, very good. I've gone back up to all quite a lot. I had a phone call. I had a phone call and it kind of threw me off as to where I was. That's why I've sort of gone back up. Um, Alice in Wonderland. It was actually my son on the phone telling me about how to get into his. Coming through the back door. Don't come in through the front door. Um, something to do with the cats, I don't know. I was like, get off the phone, because I'm recording, but, yeah. Uh, Big Hero 6 there. A couple of baby drivers. One with a slip, one without. It took me ages to watch Baby Driver. It had been out a good few years. Ball and Cell Block 99, that was good. Battlestar Galactica there. And Battlestar Galactica Blood and Chrome. That's the original against the new remakes. What else do we have? Oh yeah, Bad Mums. Um, what's that? Let's have a double take. Spartacus at the Bolshoi Ballet. The Russian Ballet. Mm, what's that common? I've got no idea what that's about. There we go. Um, scanning the bottom now. It's quite interesting because... When I was filming the next section, there was a geezer stood next to me who works in the place. And he was actually tidying up the films. Um, oh look, there's Elvis, £18. That's out of print. That's very hard to get a hold of. I do have it. Anyway, so at this point, he's actually to my left. He was to my right. Now he's to my left. And behind me, very close, is another plinth that runs down the middle with... with DVD on and he had turned around and we're side by side I'm sort of down quite low at one point sort of like crouching so's he and he sort of clocks what I'm filming and, and looks at me I, I'm aware that he's looking at me I see him out of my peripheral vision I say nothing to him I don't say anything I just carry on he doesn't say anything to me um, yeah um, but he clocked me and well you know what's the worst going to happen he asked me not to film Fair enough, and I'll stop filming. But I don't ask permission when I go, I just film. There we go. Um, oh, there's a couple of pickups there that I, 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 you just got to see very briefly. So you know already that I'm picking some stuff up. Um, I'm trying to try hide them. Oh, there they are. There we go. Um, so, Romance in the Stone. So I think it was around this point that he's actually clocked me um, now and. I just sort of ignore the fact that he's looked at me and, and carried on. Um, yeah. So, you know, it's nice, it's always nice to see a new store, but there wasn't a great deal in here really or anything, but a couple of pickups nonetheless. All right, so CEX is done. There was a couple of items picked up in there. Um, took them off of the voucher. And now I'm just going to go and visit my son in his new house and see his new cat and kittens, plural.
Okay, so I'm back home and I know that this camera is angled somewhat differently than what it usually is. Um, that is because uh, my tripod's downstairs and I'm lazy and can be bothered to walk down and get it. So, yes, had a lovely day out at my son's. Um, first time I saw these kittens, I wanted to go over and see them. I love animals. I adore, you know, he, he's him and his... Um, girlfriend soon to be fiance um they they adopted this mother cat um some of the kittens her kittens were meant to go to someone else but they blew out on on taking them um so they said they would take all three of them a bit of a handful but good luck to them you know um it's their babies at the moment so fantastic so there we go cex in horsham like i said never been to horsham before um ever in my life so it's nice to get to a new CEX a little bit disappointing on, on what they had in there nothing to speak of um overly you know too much I did pick up two items though two films that, that I one film I haven't got in the collection which is a film that I saw a long long time ago it's a Nicolas Cage movie um and it is the film Wind Talkers um yeah the one where You've got the Indian fella, the, the you know, the translator. Um, I haven't seen this for probably nigh on 20 years. Wow. Um, but yeah. So, and I do like Nicolas Cage. Um, so, fantastic. It's in great condition as well. Almost brand new like. So, there's Wind Talkers. Fantastic. Um, and the second one. I love a submarine movie. Um, film set on board a submarine, they intrigue me, submarines intrigue me, and thusly I picked up the movie Phantom for £1.50, starring Ed Harris, who's a fantastic actor in his own right, I like Ed Harris a lot, and David Duchovny stars in this as well, um, comes with a slip cover, but £1.50 for a submarine film I haven't seen, um, I'm not expecting it to be great or anything, but yeah, so... There we go. There are the two pickups from that CEX trip out. Um, I've been to my son's before. I didn't bother looking whether Horsham had a CEX. And it just sort of occurred to me. I wonder if there's a CEX down there. Lo and behold, yes, there was. Um, there we go. Um, will I visit every time I go Horsham? No. No, I won't. Because um, like I said, I was somewhat disappointed with what they had in there. Um, so what I might do every time I go is I might look online. If there's nothing of interest, I won't bother going around. Um, cause it does take a bit of time out of the day. Oh, so sorry. I'm so tired. Um, but yeah, so there we go. Um, done and dusted. And I'm off. And I shall see you all on the next one. So take care all. And have a fantastic day. Fantastic evening. Whatever you're doing. Um, keep safe. See you all very, very soon.